Hey everybody and welcome to another Stone Gaming Productions. This is Dark Souls 2 Scar the First in Let's Play. So, let's play. In our previous episode, we got the fiery sword and stuck it in the stone. <laughs> oh, we got all the way down here. What is this? The third bonfire? This is the main bonfire in this DLC. Yep. Third bonfire. Doing pretty good. We only have three other bonfires. One is the alternative boss. And actually right now we kind of need, we need to go up because we need to get the smelter wedges. Because we need four smelter wedges in order to do the final boss fight. So we need to go attempt to retrieve those. You can actually jump down there and get an item. But this is where I'm trying to go right now. This is actually uh, that area where I was talking about the NPCs that are hell. It's over there. I don't know if we have that key yet, though. But we'll check before we go down. If we have that key, then yeah, we'll go over there and we'll experience that hell. Yeah, I noticed the tracks. You see those tracks? That means you could do, that means that you can move that fire. I could push it back down to the other side if I wanted to now. Boop, and there she goes. <laughs> This is the area where I was talking about that you need uh, this wall right here. With this guy right here. Move. There it is. Dispelling ring plus one. Kind of nice. Because, yeah, you know the whole idea of the dispelling ring. But, durability from 110 to 35. Kind of garbage. So, I don't know. I like the original, but if you're not going to be getting eroded on all the damn time, then, you know, it's a good, good way to go. Holy! Okay, we gotta run. And we're too heavy, did you see that? We are too heavy. Holy crap. Oh man! I was hoping I could go through that and get them killed going through it, but... Instead, it was murdering me. I was sitting there wondering, I was, I was actually thinking to myself, is that, is that enough health to run through there? And that's, that's why I fidgeted. Then I was like, well, I really don't have a choice. I either die by the fire or I die by these two assholes. So, you know, I chose the fire. Because there was a possibility that maybe I might be able to damn it. Oh, I missed my elevator. Despair. Okay. <laughs> Oops. Okay. <laughs> So, we're not going to do that again. I was thinking of trying to grab, show you those items, but... 
Um, evidently, you need to jump, not roll, or you need to roll off higher. I was kind of close. I was like right there. I don't know. I was kind of hoping that that was like a lip or something. Yeah, look at me, super hollow. Yay. I get to consume another damn effigy because it's so friggin' awesome to lose those. You're not cool unless you've used a whole bunch of effigies. Oh, look, we got a retrieval on nothing. Oh, my God. Oh, what's the point? That's because our souls were up there. Yeah, and we lost them because we were an idiot. Yeah, what, I am really stupid. I could have rolled onto that platform and not that other one. Congratulations, I am an idiot. <laughs> I really need these damn wedges. Let's see how many follow. Oh, they all want to follow. That works for me. It looked like he was going to throw that at me or something, huh? And the box. This is the box that we've been trying to get. Smelter wedge time four. Yeah. So I guess we could have gone and gotten that other one. It's alright, really? That one's a, such a huge bitch. It is. It's just, uh... Although, truthfully, what I did that for is because I want... The first thing I need to do is... I've done a playthrough and I've, like, just casually gone through and, like, Oh, yeah, I'll just, you know, ran into a smelter and I'm like, Yeah, I'll just, you know, kill this thing. And then I, uh... I only had three smelter wedges for the final boss fight. So, to prevent that from ever happening, I want... Now that we have those, go straight down. Even though we still have some stuff to do upstairs. Because I want to go to the final bonfire and I want to get rid of those smelter wedges. Oh, really? I don't know. We could go down there and just fight him. It is possible. I mean, <laughs> it is possible. I'm pretty sure we don't have this key yet. Yeah. Although, actually, I think you get that key from over here, don't you? Yeah, you do. Totally do. Key to that door? It's right over here. Stand up and get blowed up. That's all you guys are good for.
Okay, now. So we don't have any more idiots. That hammer he has, ow, is so awesome. But holy crap, it hurts. That's good. I, I, I kind of like the fact that he actually has a boundary to how far he'll go. Oh, how'd you miss me? Because now you're dead. I really want... I don't have the gold serpent. I have the silver serpent. I want his hammer. There's another, actually in this DLC you can get his hammer, but I think, I think you have to be on New Game Plus in order to guarantee to get that hammer because they put a phantom, one of those big monsters in there. And yeah, that's, that's always fun. This is the key we need. Tower key. Not that hammer. That hammer's meh, but... I don't even know, like truthfully, I kinda... Now that we got the key, I kinda just say screw everything, cause these guys suck. This is since I haven't done any damage to him at all yet. I, And look at how little that does. <laughs> yeah, okay. Because you're really going to be able to do that to this guy. Holy crap. He will cross the line if you push him to. Yeah, he'll really cross the line if you push him to. <laughs> and he turned around. You were not supposed to turn around, guy. I was gonna run up behind him and like, try to hit him. I like how he's just gonna sit there and just let me shoot him. There's another one that comes out too. Oh yeah, because that's so worth it. So is that. Well, that is. Twinkling, that's always worth it. At the G. Yay, oh Jesus. That's actually that key will also get us to that uh, upstairs area for sure. And this is the old. Is it the alternate? No, it's not. Or yes, it is. This is the alternate boss fight. Down here, way down here. It is the blue smelter. Magic smelter, yeah. Fucking wrap your brain around that one. Iron passage. This is that other alternative boss fight, and yeah, ain't nobody want to help you down there. 
Blah, blah, it's hell. It's fucking hell. It's so bad. Oh my god. Uh, let's see if anybody wants to help. Yep, see, no. Those are just two NPCs. They're pretty much worthless. And that's the bottom bottom. Which we are headed that way. Doing pretty good. I'm just kind of mowing through all of these. This is the one that we need to get down. And heads up, if you don't want to miss an item, you're going to need to jump right now. Are we ready? Count of three. Get the spin going. One, two, three, jump. Oh. <laughs> There's an item up here that you will miss. Not only that, a better way to entering uh, over here, you'll see in a minute. If you hit one, if you hit this wrong, like you could literally just go into a never ending fall and just end up, you won't die from the fall, but you'll end up down there with one of those giant freaking uh, demon things that ooze the lava out of their pits every other second. But yeah, see. But yeah, see this, that, if you step on that, there's one right below it, and another one below it, another one below it, another one below it, and they're just never-ending friggin' fall of just doom. See? If we could get an enemy on there, that'd be so awesome, but that ain't gonna happen. I think they know. Jeez, I'm gonna need some more life gems, eh? Dude, that one's huge. Although that one, I guess you could maybe stop right here if you're lucky. But if you're over there, then you're going to fall down there with that demon. And again, good thing we have magic. Because see... That's the sound bitch to be down here waiting for you. He's got the scary looking hammer, not the really cool one. And he'll just stand there and just take it like a man. Make sure you back up too. When you spam like this, he lunges forward. See that lunge? And if you don't back up, you will just lunge off the edge here, so be careful. Yeah, just die, please and thank you. I really don't want to deal with your crap. They hit hard, they stagger, so you know. I'd go down there and fight them, but I just... I don't want to. My stats aren't where they want, where I want them to be in order to be fighting like that with big motherfuckers. 
I, I would need a whole lot more vitality. Although I am rolling perfect right now. But that's because I don't have a helmet. I need a, I should technically have a helmet on. This area, all the, see that guy's alive, but that armor is gonna come alive and there's another one. And the best suggestion for this area is just to run. I don't know, I guess, yeah, cause these guys are, I don't know. Yeah, there's, I mean, there's literally nothing out here other than them. Although I'm remembering some shit down there. That's right, he won't come alive until I'm down here. How did he miss me with that attack? I don't even know. He's not dead. That's why his health bar is still there. See, they're gonna come back to life right now. There is an item over there with a chest. Although truthfully, we're just gonna run away like a scared little bitch. they all go back if they all go back oh they're not all going back I want to get that item at the same time like I need these souls I'm trying to keep them I want to light this bonfire you know I'm not trying to get myrtleized key is hug this wall if you don't the big guys are going to come out Although, truthfully, I think they actually might have removed them from this side. I think. Because I went through here and I was being cocky. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to go fuck these guys up. And I I messed them up. And then it's like, well, then I came over here and actually, I don't think I don't think they are over here. But we don't have the cojones to test that theory as of right now. Because we're not really wanting to scramble with those guys. It's not going to be so much fun, you know. There's an NPC there. That's not a person, that's an NPC. That's a uh, Corellian of the Fold, their teacher from Majula and uh, No Man's Wharf, I think it's called. The one with the big old pirate ship in the cave. I think it's called No Man's Wharf. Sounds right. That's another NPC. That is not an NPC. Maximus. That actually sounds familiar. We're summoning him. I guess we're going to do this battle right now, ladies and gentlemen. 
Because we have somebody who wants to help. Can I get that damn thing off my screen so I can see what I'm doing, please, and thank you? So I think that's a life gem, but I'm not 100%. Yeah, it is. Let's go battle. He knows what time it is, I'm sure. Or not. Shit. Okay, I was kind of hoping that he wouldn't rush in because I wanted to buff so I could get the couple of free hits in, but I guess not. Oops, and I missed. Try not to miss. But you also don't, I don't know, you don't want to get that close. And if you do get this close, I think this guy is that, the guy that you're going to want to roll, roll, bleh, roll into, not roll away from. So you're going to want to roll up and then like try to get behind him. Don't try to roll away from him because it's not going to work because of the range in which he has. Oh, hey. He does not like magic, by the way. If you notice, that's why he just like all of a sudden stopped everything and went after Carillion of the Fold. Because he hates magic. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> we took out the fume knight. Thank you, Maximus. Crown of the old king. There are actually two more boss fights in this DLC. There's the alternative boss, the Iron Iron Passage. Okay. Um. Before he figures out how to get in here. <laughs> I'm gonna run away. Okay. Yeah, there's this boss, and then there's also another one, the final bonfire here that we're missing. And we get that from going there. The main the main fire. Cause this is how you get to everywhere. 
literally everywhere. Thinking I'm gonna go light that bonfire. Damn it. And then maybe we'll go try to mess with that NPC invader. Not doing it. That just leads to that one area. That door doesn't open from that side. I have to open it from the other side first. And actually, I'm not 100% on how to do that, truthfully. So I don't know how we're going to do that. But, I don't know. Maybe we'll run into it, maybe we won't. Most important thing is that we're getting all the bonfires and we're getting all the bosses. And don't forget, I forgot about that one in Sanctum City. I did not forget. Yeah. Come here, asshole. Get away from her. She heals. Oh, wow. Oh, the bleed. Oh. Yeah. These guys are a pain in the ass. Normally, I like to get help with these guys because they suck so bad. I guess I could just run through, but I kind of wanted to get the uh, the smelter there. You know? Like... Fuck. Um, well, shit. I guess we could, we could run. I mean could try I mean <laughs> we could try to run there's no guarantees that it's gonna work because there's like a good six of them so there's that although we need to get that bonfire so we might just run past them because god they're such I don't, they're, they're just bitches plain and simple they're little punks and they fight like chicken shits and You'd have to fight like a chicken shit. And I hate fighting like a chicken shit. You know, like, ugh. There's one, two, or is that three, four, five, six? Yeah, there's six of them. That's all. Most important part, that's a memory. That's uh, another boss fight. We're going to come over here. We're going to light this bonfire. And then what happens, happens. Uh-oh. No, my turn, my turn, my turn. My turn, dude! Okay, fine. <sighs> They're all like, yay! We over... We outmanned him and murdered him. Like, dude, that's, that's nothing to boast about. You can fight like a bitch. Yay! Bitches unite! I what the hell? But yeah, this is the bonfire, this is the memory. This is another gross fight. <laughs> it is. But you know what? 
that's all the bonfires in this DLC. We just have two bosses we need to handle. Hmm. I think I think I'm gonna call this an episode. I don't know, we can go in here I guess. Oh no, we're gonna make that an episode. Yep, so thanks for watching. Uh hit that like and subscribe and I will hit see you guys on the next one.